explain the protocol for using TheraBand kinesiology tape and BioFreeze at the same time. First thing is that you want to prepare the skin as you normally would for kinesiology taping. Once that's been done, we can then apply the kinesiology tape just as you normally would. Uh, for example, what we'll do is we'll apply one end of the kinesiology tape with no tension, and then we'll remove the paper backing and apply the tape as we normally would. We can apply as much tension as we need to using the TheraBand stretch, uh, TheraBand kinesiology tape stretch indicators. And then what we'll do is place uh, our tape and remove the paper for the last part of the anchor. And then what we'll do is we'll rub the paper backing on the tape itself to activate the adhesive. Once we've properly applied the kinesiology tape, then what we want to do is come with BioFreeze and we want to spray not just on the tape, but around the area as well. So what we'll do is just do a general spraying on the tape as well as around it. The key here when you're using kinesiology tape with BioFreeze at the same time is always apply the tape first and then apply BioFreeze after that. Never apply BioFreeze before you apply the tape. That doesn't allow the menthol to breathe. So what we want to do is to apply the tape first and then spray it with BioFreeze and that can be reapplied up to four times a day.